Thank you for choosing MTG Burgeoning for your Magic the Gathering content. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoy this video and consider becoming a subscriber. Doing so supports the channel and makes you eligible for our various subscriber rewards series. If you would like to support the channel further, then click the link to our Patreon page in the description below. There, you can join our ongoing Pack Wars series as a one-month supporter or ongoing member. Or, try joining Pack Wars for free by commenting on every MTG burgeoning video in a month. We strive to offer creative rewards through our various Patreon tiers. So if Pack Wars isn't for you, then something else will be. Links to our content and various subscriber rewards series can be found in the description below. Send us an email, follow us on Twitter, follow us on Instagram. We are your channel for all things magic. Click the link to MTG Burgeoning's Introduction to Plane Chase in the description below. Glenelendra's static ability provides you with the option of, at the end of combat, exchanging control of target creature you control that dealt combat damage to a player this combat and target creature that player controls. Whenever you roll Chaos, gain control of target creature you own. Although our opponents will want their creatures back, I'm not so sure we'll want ours. If I were playing Plane Chase Commander, and I wanted to add Glenelendra to the Planar deck, then I would construct an EDH deck for the purposes of exploiting this plane's static ability. The general that comes to mind is Yuriko the Tiger Shadow. Since we are crafting a build to take advantage of unblockable creatures, selecting Yuriko as the commander of this deck allows us to incorporate an opponent-wide life-draining effect whenever a ninja we control deals combat damage to a player. To aid with the unblockable theme of this deck, let's include Douthi Embrace. Creatures with Shadow can only be blocked by other creatures with Shadow. Rogue's Passage, Manifold Key, and Suspicious Bookcase are must-adds. For additional creature swap shenanigans, let's include Bronze Bombshell. After this exchange, our opponent is left with one less creature and seven less life. Rust Elemental ensures that an opponent is either sacrificing artifacts or losing four life each turn. Gifting a player with either Steel Golem or Grid Monitor is cruel and unusual punishment, but we'll be okay with it because it is better to give than to receive. Most of the time. Lastly, just in case our opponents have malice in their hearts and plan to use our gifts to their advantages, Despotic Scepter will end those dreams very, very quickly.